Hey everyone, welcome back to Gina's Beauty Room, my beauty room. So today I'm gonna to be showing you what's on my vanity. I am always changing things out on top of my vanity. I'm always rearranging. The setup is always different. I, I love switching my vanity, like the top of my vanity out with different acrylics. And, and I love to organize my makeup in those acrylics. That way it's, more, it's easily accessible to me to use all my makeup items. But yes, just recently I switched everything out on my vanity behind me. So I do wanna show you guys what's new let's just go ahead and get started okay so here is my vanity setup and you guys it is always always changing if you are new here i'd love to have you join my family as i do a lot of these vanity tours reorganizational videos and you know hopefully you can take some inspiration from these videos of mine and incorporate into your beauty space and yeah let's just get started right if you are returning i don't know if you can spot new items on my my vanity <laughs> you probably can let's go ahead and start from this side and then we'll work our way to this side so as you can see i kind of customized my vanity space by using ikea mickey desks i have two of them right there i got the ikea six drawer um, Alex drawers and then I got the five drawer right here and I did pick up this chair it's a swivel chair from home goods I think it was like 139 it, it is a hot pink but it looks red almost I did just from far away just the bigger items I did pick up this dream and XOXO from home goods recently and they were for $14.99 a piece my vanity mirror is from Impressions Vanity. And then this smaller one, I purchased it on Amazon. If I can find it, I will link it down below. This I also purchased on Amazon. And it's such a good, sturdy little Alex dupe. Like Ikea Alex dupe, you know what I mean? And I do love the way the drawers open. And I love the depth of the each drawer. So it holds a lot of items. It is shallow though. It's not as deep as like this or that one. This table too was a little extra table I got. It's like a portable foldable table I got on Amazon. Uh, I think they did have a couple of colors. So that I also will link down below. And let's just get a closer look. So these Mickey desks from Ikea, they did not come with these little knobs. These knobs I got at Home Goods. So it's like a pack of six. I think I paid $9.99. This fridge I also picked up on Amazon. I think it was about maybe $139 I picked it up. But what's cool about this one, so there's the brand right there. The top opens up separate from the bottom so your whole fridge doesn't need to open up i forget what liter it is but it's it's a it is a large one i'd say okay so up here i have my imac this little cover right here this cute little stretchable computer monitor tv cover i picked up on amazon and i just recently purchased another one for that monitor but I didn't realize in the, I have to wash it, but see how I got like dark right here? It's because the ventilation on these IMAX are at the bottom. So I had it completely covered and it, yeah, it just needs to be washed. So, um, yeah, so now I pick it up here just like that. That way the vents can be exposed. This little clock I got on Amazon as well. You're going to see a lot of these items I purchased on Amazon and then I get a lot of my acrylics pre-owned on eBay. And uh, yeah, so I, as we go on, I'll tell you where I got different items from. Okay, so here, let's see here. So these are two, I'm pretty sure you've seen these. If I lift this up, this is two sets of from Muji. Muji.com, they they're an acrylic storage container online shop. So I do have two of these stacked right here. And then I have another one right there, if you can see. I do like the way they, they slide out. Very, very nice quality. 
two smaller ones right there if you can see so yeah it just the drawers slide out very very easily great quality acrylics most of all i love how they're stackable and then this one i purchased pre-owned on ebay from a seller that has a lot of test tube equipment and everything so it's from basically like a um it, it's used to hold how do you say it medical stuff so it's like a medical grade acrylic so it's very very thick so i really really like that i have a couple of them which i'll show you in a moment i use it to hold my palettes and you know i have some notepads down here and then right here i just have a little glass container votive large votive i found at the thrift shop along with this little thing and i glued it together so it's real pretty i like the way it came out and then here's another one you see this so just recently i purchased a set of two of these on ebay pre-owned of course and then these i found a set of two these are like votive candle holders they're vintage a set of two at the thrift store for like five dollars and i even think i got it half off of that but i just hot glued them together with the glue gun and that's how it looks beautiful you can do some creative stuff for your vanity area and then this is just an external mic you can plug in uh, usb and you know do voiceovers or stuff like that so up here i do have these two they're like miniature nail polish wall racks they are great quality acrylics they're one of a kind i have yet to find where they sell these there was no brand or anything on it but a seller on amazon or on ebay was selling it to for maybe like 45 dollars. so i snatched those up really really quick <laughs> and i decided to hang it right there so what else what else these shelves up here are they're like protruding floating shelves i did pick up those on amazon along with shorter floating shelves there which holds the xoxo and the dream um, lights there so i do have little trinkets up there and everything so just to you know spice up the space at one point i did put like makeup palettes all up there and it looked really nice okay so right here i did find this eyelash holder i think it holds five pairs on amazon i do have this i found at the thrift shop it, it was like kind of beat up and dirty so i cleaned it and i used cardstock to cover with just tape to cover this cardboard area where a photo was supposed to be and then i had this knob this acrylic knob already and i just drilled a hole or put a hole there and just put the knob there so now this is how it looks i got my one size powder uh really enjoy it i really like that it's a little bit drying but overall it's a very nice loose setting powder and then of course i have this this cover i think i got on amazon yeah and then this MTV mouse pad I got on eBay. Of course, it's pre-owned. I grew up on MTV, watching like the real world and all those kind of shows. Okay, so up here, I did purchase this little acrylic organizer at Home Goods. I think it was like $14.99. It's very cute. I love the gold accent on this knob. And then in here, I just hold some lippies and then my toner and my uh, emulsion right there so the, here i do have a different powder so i do have it labeled with an m at the bottom Ooh, very dirty uh, so in here i do have my maybelline loose setting powder and then if we go on to here i have some brushes makeup brushes with this hold it's a martha stewart one i picked up at uh tj maxx and then this acrylic little thing, I got it pre-owned on eBay. You guys, I find a lot of these acrylics on eBay. I just type in the search bar, pre-owned makeup organizers and, and just different items pop up, you know, from sellers. 
So in here, I just have most of my used items, of course, easily accessible up here on my vanity. These coasters, I got a set of five and they're silicone coasters and they're glow in the dark. I got them at a thrift store as well here locally where I live. I got my raspberry jam donut. I've been loving that scent. That was from last holiday season. Yeah. Okay, this little votive I picked up at the thrift store as well. I cleaned it up really good. It's like a tea light candle holder. I just have my most used lippies that I've been reaching for lately. This one is so nice from, I got it from um, um, TJ Maxx. And it comes in a set of three, but this is so, so nice on the lips. Okay, so this right here this hasn't changed since since my last vanity tour but this is a eyeglass acrylic tower like a display tower that a store had so this was pre-owned as well uh, but in very good condition and they packed it really well for the shipment and yeah no damage and i think it was black before so i painted it with a chalk paint white and this is how it looks Oh, you guys, I do have my new camera. I need to mess with it. I got it for my birthday. My birthday was uh, March 29th. And you guys, I've been messing around with it along with this monitor I put here, this Samsung monitor, and it is nice. It's kind of tricky because usually I'll use this phone, the one I'm filming with right now, and, and just upgrading to an actual like camera, it's, it's tricky. <laughs> so I have to learn it. Then I have this I Love You a Latte DW candle. I got it Home Goods. And then back here, I have my skincare tower. So this one I also got pre owned on eBay, and it is such a great thick plastic acrylic tower, like a turn tower. Lazy Susan. <laughs> but yes, it works so good for skincare. And then here in front of the monitor, I do have um, just little trinkets like this is from the thrift store. I glued that together like the other one. This one is so cute. It's a miniature Kleenex box. So I got this one on, on eBay as well. It was like a or best offer kind of thing. So I offered them. They accepted it. And oh my gosh, it is so cute. It's vintage. It's beautiful. Okay, so here's my Cody Airspun. So this I also got on eBay used. It's vintage. All these are like vintage items. And I just put my Cody Airspun in here. See it? Which is my most used face powder. Love it. So this little thing I also picked up at a local thrift store. And it's, I think you use it for napkins. It's like, it's a napkin holder, I think. See? So I just put some of my cute palettes there, my Cara Beauty palettes that I pick up at Marshalls and TJ Maxx and stuff. So over here, this is a new little setup area. So this mirror was just directly on the vanity, but I added these right here. So it's a two of these little towers, acrylic towers. I did purchase those for $19.99 at Home Goods, and every once in a while I'll see them back at Home Goods. So you can still try to look for them there um, if you do have a Home Goods near you. But these are very, very good acrylic. They slide very easily, as you can see. So I just have some eye pencils. I got nail products. I got my remote for the light right there, the ring light. What else, what else? So here I have my pens in here. This I got at the thrift store too, actually. I think it was for like a dollar, but it's like a real pretty little flower and I added a little flower pen I picked up at, uh, at the Dollar Tree. So I have two of my short kabuki brushes that I've been using. And then here I did pick up this on eBay pre-owned and it's just like a little jewelry trinket box you know it's all acrylic very thick acrylic very very pretty so these are all my makeup brushes so I just recently put this here which previously I had skincare on this so this one is just like a two-tier acrylic 
holder bathroom holder i got on amazon so this i'll also link down below i love it i love it love it love it it holds a lot it's a little bit flimsy but for the most part if you put items on there it'll stay sturdy and overall you can put like heavy items as you can see i have all my foundations and you guys it is a great little acrylic piece so yeah, I have my Ray Dunn little brush holders. I found, I think it's like a stationary holder, like pencils and pens like that, but I'm using it for makeup brushes. So those I found, you're not going to believe the price. They were only $6.99 per holder at Home Goods. Yeah. This one is also like a ceramic, but it was $3.99 at Marshalls. And it's like a very pale pink. So moving on here, I do have, oh, let me go right here. I do have my Raspberry Gem Donut Lotion that I love. That's my all-time favorite Bath & Body Lotion, if you were wondering, <laughs> if you're curious. Okay, so here I do have more of those test tube acrylic things I got pre-owned on eBay. And I'm telling you guys, these are thick, very, very thick acrylic. And they make just my palettes very easily accessible so i just slide my palettes in here and it's been working so well and it even holds like the the large profusion palettes like this very very nicely and of course i can see my palettes so i'm more prone to using them so on the top i just have some fragrances just a variety i got from Victoria's Secret. I got my Romance, which is my all-time favorite perfume from Ralph Lauren. I do have a miniature Strawberry Pound Cake Bath & Body Spray. I do have these right here. These are cute. I love the bottles of these. Exclamation Perfume. This one you can pick up at Walmart. Um, let me see. So this, this little lipstick holder, is it is vintage, and I did purchase it on eBay pre-owned as well. I have yet to see another one. As soon as I see stuff like this, I just purchase it right away because I love to display my makeup in these unique acrylic um, organizers or, you know what I mean? Like, I just love to do that. This Hello Kitty I found pre-owned on eBay. It's just like a little toy, little Hello Kitty makeup caboodle, you know, for a little toddler. I do have my Ariana Grande perfume. Um, you know, just different little stuff here and there, like these little containers from Sanrio and stuff like that, Twin Stars. Um, I got on Amazon, yeah, on Amazon. I just got a, you know, a little cute pineapple mirror right here. I picked up from maybe Marshalls or something like that. I got more body sprays. And then this one I picked up on Amazon. Look how cute this is. It's just little wipes. I use them for swatching uh, for the most part. Um, this little acrylic organizer I got at Home Goods, and I just store some makeup brushes, just like a pink item items I have here. I, I even have like, I don't know, I just mix up all my stuff. Just as long as I can see it, I'm more capable of using it. <laughs> All right, so this tier thing, this is was labeled an hors d'oeuvre, like appetizer acrylic tower for serving. It's like a serving dish. And you guys, look how beautiful this is. And I just put my like lippies. Isn't that beautiful? And then so this one was the Ariana Grande uh, perfume holder. So I took it, you know, off of the perfume and I just use it for more pins and stuff, highlighters. And then this one was also pre-owned on eBay. So this is a countertop store display, like candy display. As you, If you can see right here, you can put like a little, I think is what they used it for, like the labels, you know, of the candy and stuff. So there's two of them. And yeah, I love how it's tiered. So it stores my little trinkets, you know, whatever you want really well. So these, I'm always searching for more, and I have yet to find any more of those. Like I said, it's they're pre-owned, so they're hard to find. But when you come across them, uh, you are going to pay you know, a pretty penny for those as well because they're unique. This tower, everybody asks for this tower. So it is like a Lazy Susan, so it's it turns. Uh, right now, I don't have it turning because this is on the way. But this I also picked up 
on eBay pre-owned and I think it was it's it's a display a countertop display for I think uh postcards you know so that's pretty cool and I store all my color pop the majority is my color pop palettes and then here I just have a Ray Dunn brush holder I found for $4.99 at Marshalls and then this little turning acrylic organizer I purchased at Home Goods. I think this was maybe I want to say like $8.99 and yeah it just turns very easily. So here at the end cap I just have this tower I've had since I I, I can remember I've had this little piece and it was wooden and I painted it pink I chalk painted it pink all these um if you were if you were to see my last vanity tour like what's on my vanity I showed you these books I pick all these books up at the thrift stores and I put them together just to come up with a pastel themed um little end cap right here and I think it worked out very well it looks so so pretty and then down here I have you know more trinkets like those I picked up at I think I picked them up at home goods I want to say for like $4.99 they're little ceramic cupcakes but I think that is it I mean I do have more acrylic holders there with all this is like all my skincare so all my skincare is here so it can be easily ac accessible in the mornings. So that works out really well. So yeah, I think that that is it though. My my lamps you see there, I picked them up at Home Goods. I think they were like $14.99 a piece. I love the fact that they have the protruding butterflies on the lampshades. I think that's very, very nice. But yes, yeah, so here is an overview of all my vanity. So thank you so much for joining me. I'm hoping you did enjoy my updated vanity tour. And I'm hoping that you took away some tips and tricks from this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not subscribed already. And I will see you on the next one. Bye.